1913 and we are let's playing King's Quest 7. In the last episode we got a bunch of ingredients for the Rosella to be turned back into you know, thing. Really, I've had so much trouble sleeping lately. Blotar snores like a dragon with heartburn. Well, let me tell you, Eglatine, I have the same problem with Hogarth. I just use wet sulfur. I put a lump of wet sulfur in the fireplace at night, and it puts me right out. Why I sleep so soundly, Hogarth sometimes has to wake me with a flower under the nose. <laughs> a flower? Eee! You must have been sleeping like a log if you needed a nasty, smelly flower to wake you up. Well, well, well. You learn something new every day. Yes. All right, so we learned that, I guess. Let's Excuse me, good ladies, but but would you happen to know anything about Malisha? Oh, look, Winnie! It's the king's new bride to be! Isn't she the cutest little thing? Oh, my dear! You're the luckiest troll in the world! Oh, it's going to be the most beautiful wedding! And won't you be the most beautiful bride? Oh, I always cry at weddings. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> mm, stop crying. No crying and troll things. All right, so let's go. We need to hear about that sulfur in order to do something. Anyways, let's head over here. Now that we hear about the sulfur, we can have this guy go to sleep. God, it's gonna take you a long time. What's that, Mama? Time for bed? Okay. Nighty night. That fire farted in his face. So now we're gonna need to take these tongs and pick up this thing. What do we have to do? Give these to you, sir? Oh, no, 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 over here, right. Because it's hot and we can't pick it up, so we gotta put it in water. That'll cool it down. And look at that, we now have a silver spoon. Yes! Alright. What do I gotta put them back? Upstairs. We'll come back and help these guys out or something, I don't know. Today, Rosella. I liked you in the fourth game better. This game, you're a little bit of a fart. Alright, let's head this way. So what do we have here? We have a mine cart. Let's see what this is. Uh, elevator that thing. That doesn't look too stable. No, it doesn't. Let's come up over here. What is this? Oh no, it's missing a wheel, so we can use the shield as a wheel. Day, sir, I am. Well, I don't care who you are. This is my bridge, and I will only let you cross it 
Uh, if you give me a thousand pieces of lead and a rat on a stick. Uh, no. Yeah, right. All right, let's come back over here. And I'll ask you to ride it. Do not ride it. Now you put the cart there. And now ride it. Wee. Wee, I says, wee. No biting. Super dangerous. You know, using that shield was a darn good idea. If only I'd attached it to the cart somehow. Uh, I did. Back. I don't know what the hell happened. Oh. Alright, now we gotta go visit the dragon or something. Oh. Apparently it's freaking got asthma or something. Oh. I don't know. It must have asthma. That's something oh. I can... oh, it's sleeping. All right, asthma and sleeping is kind of similar. All right. Hi, dragon. Ah, uh, are you a dragon? No shit. I am. Do not fear me, little troll. You are the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my whole life. Thank you. You are most kind. Once that would have made me smile. Now I know I will never be happy again. Why? What has made you so sad? I have lost my will to live. I have lost my spark. Is that it? Alright, so we gotta oh. get her her will to live back, which apparently is an item. Let's um, get rid of this, item. this doesn't happen to be the kind of spark you meant, does it? Here. A spark! Bless you, little troll! Here, let me have it! <laughs> Yay, fire breathing. I am indebted to you. Here, take this diamond. With it, you can live like a princess. I already am. Thank you. It's it's beautiful, but what I'd really like is one of your scales. Yes, yes, little one. Whatever you want, but I can wait no longer to fly. I will give you a scale when I return. All right. Well. Look at this dragon go. I mean, this must have been pretty amazing back in the day. And how cool that must have been. Farewell! But now, it's kind of like, eh. And Quark flies off to the world of Lunar. Or is that Nong? That might be Nong. He's having a great time. He or she. I think it's probably a she. <laughs> Alright, good.
good. Yes, let's get back to what, what I was doing. Hurry up, Rosella. God, you're so slow. Hurry up! Jeez, you're crazy. Come on already. Ugh. I don't want to die, that's why I'm clicking. Hurry up, Rosella, I don't have all day. Alright. If I click on this, you'll just walk fast. I like smart walking, this is good. Let's go visit the, uh, jeweler. I think we almost have all the stuff we need. He's still sleeping, huh? Let's give this to him. Happy? I have something I'd like to give you. Oh, oh my my, it's perfect. It's beautiful. How can I ever thank you? I'm forever in your debt. Oh, I'm going to throw out this horrible hammer and chisel and get the best set money can buy. There you go. If you don't want it, may I have it, Oppie? Of course, of course. Enjoy them, my dear. Thank you so much. Goodbye, Rosella. Yay. Now he leaves, and now we gotta go back. We gotta go back to the dragon. Who should be back, hopefully. <laughs> We almost got all this stuff we need. We just need a dragon scale. And then we'll have enough stuff to go back and become a frickin' princess. Human princess. I'm just gonna click this. Alright, good. You walk very fast. They should just cut this room right out. To be honest. Christ, you're gonna walk so slow. What is she asleep again? if I have an early version of the game or what. Yay! Scale! Let's look at it in 3D. How cool. Looks like a stingray or something. Alright, let's go. We should have everything. Now let's go back and talk to Matilda. Whatever the hell her name is. Leave the dragons alone. No more dragons for me. She flew off. She had a good time. Now it's time for Rosella to go and do whatever the hell she's doing. Alright, let's talk to her. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. One more freaking screen. Talk to Matilda. Matilda, I think I have all the ingredients for the spell. Good, good. I knew you were special, girl. Give me the gold bowl first. Alright. Here it is. Mm-hmm. Good. Now give me the rest of the ingredients. Alright, here's the beetles. Just 
fine, just dandy. And here's your silver spoon. Excellent! And here's the scale. Yes! Yes! <laughs> that should be it, right? All right then, girly, take a drink. Oh. I thought I would have to click on it. It feels like this game's more cutscene than anything, huh? Did it work? Well, not exactly, dear. Now, what did I do wrong? Aha! Uh -huh. I remember. We need a troll hair. Ow! There we go! Yeah, this game, game definitely feels more comical than anything. You know what I mean? Hmm. The silver spoon melted. And I thought Mother's tea was strong. I suppose I should keep it as a memento. Hey, thanks for monologuing right there. Uh-oh. My dear Princess Rosella, I'm stunned! Your beauty is only surpassed by your intelligence, in your courage, and your joie de vivre! You! I've had just about enough of you distracting the king, you little snip! She barely distracted him. Now look here, lady! No! Look here! Malicia! No! There. You just be patient, girl. I'll be in to take care of you before you know it. All right. <laughs> Thanks, magic lady. Can I do stuff? That's now? what you think. Rosella's escaped more things than you'll know. Anyways, as you can see, purple eyes and there's some smoke. Oh, that's odd. Where's that smoke coming from? I don't know. Why don't we investigate it? I kind of like this music, though. I... No, it's not tall enough yet. Yeah, how about you let me grab this? And there we go. My lady Malicia, I wasn't expecting you! And who were you expecting, you pathetic wretch? Your precious princess? There's a lot of cuts. Listen things. to me, you pudding brained puppet. If you and your obsession with that pale skinned, meddlesome princess manage to disrupt my plans, I'll have you filleted. Have you learned to work the volcano mechanism yet? Well, yes, I, I think so, but Lady Malicia, is it really necessary? Will the realm of Eldritch be hard, my lady? The Bountiful Woods are right below Etheria, and the land of Ooga Booga below that. Oh, a village here, a township there, who's going to miss them? Even if all of Eldritch is covered in slag, at least the blight of Etheria will be gone. What is she, Corella Deville? She doesn't even walk, she floats. She's this is a dumb dumb villain. I just don't know what's right. 
what's real. If only I could remember. Oh no, she can't, she just can't. I guess we'll pick up the frog. Alright, apparently we can't. Anyways, I'm gonna stop the video here in the next episode. We'll continue exploring. This has been Kenshin1913. I'll see you later. Bye bye.